Oh, come on, this is gonna be fun. We're trying cardio drumming. Uh, it's a program we've wanted to do for a long time. Uh, right now, it's a perfect opportunity for us to do it. Um, the kids, they love the, the rhythm, they love the music, they love the dancing, they love the movement, and have a great time doing it. So you're taking advantage of, of having slightly fewer kids in the building, right? And with reduced numbers, a great opportunity for us to try it and see how it would go for full class sizes. And tell me a little bit about the equipment. So you've got the buckets. Tell me where you got those from. So we actually got those donated from Home Depot. Yay, Home Depot! Yes, yes. So thank you, Home Depot. And then we um, we ordered the yoga balls, and then we already had the sticks, so it actually worked out. So I see us, you know, incorporating movement, music, and then you're doing it safely too. So you're cleaning everything in between, and the kids are spaced out in the gym. It's fantastic. It's Great job. Our guidance counselor is meeting one-on-one -on -one with students for what we are calling a one-minute check-in. Like an SEL check-in? Mm -hmm. I have a couple questions for you, okay? It's more to just check well-being and see if there are things that we can do to support the child. I heard really positive responses from kids, but is she getting some not-so-positive responses from She's kids? getting some, yes. Um, the neat benefit of technology and the Google form and everything is she can then kind of take all of that data and put it into small groups and then start to meet with those students having similar needs. At this level. Oh, no, I'm Look how sad it is. Every year we do our storybook pumpkin um, parade. Children, she's a piece of literature to decorate a pumpkin. This year we really can explore different ways to include our virtual and our in-person learners. So this way our families who have chosen virtual can interact with the campus in a non-threatening way. So they've dropped off their pumpkins. Um, they have the ability to come up and tour. Um, and then that way they also have the beauty of experiencing some of the fun, relevant learning here at campus. There is no doubt that we're in a global pandemic. There is also no doubt that Whitestone Elementary School is totally rocking what they're doing with kids, both in person and virtual. So thank you to our incredible faculty for the work that they're doing with these amazing kids. Happy Halloween, everybody. <laughs>